It's been a whirlwind, whirlwind few months for the newest member of Ohio's Supreme Court. Local appeals judge Mary DiGennaro was appointed recently to fill an unexpired term as justice just about six weeks after learning the position was going to be available. As First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti tells us, Justice DiGennaro hopes to hold on to the job after her appointment runs out. Ohio's newest Supreme Court justice sees this as a chance to show off the valley to the rest of the state. This is the, the people that I come from. This is the kind of judge I've been. I have an opportunity to show you the kind of justice I will be. Late last month, Governor Kasich appointed Mary D. Gennaro to fill a vacancy left by the now retired Justice Bill O'Neill. She becomes the first judge from Mahoning County to sit on the Supreme Court since Justice Paul Brown was elected in the mid 60s. But D. Gennaro has had her eyes on the high court since 2014 when she started traveling the state looking to win support from GOP leaders. If you do not get the party's endorsement, you are to stand down. That's what happened two years ago. But then things changed. People came to me and encouraged me to think about it in 2018. And after talking with my family and thinking about it, um, I opted to pursue the party's endorsement. But just as her campaign was getting underway, she learned O'Neill would be stepping down. She tells me she had roughly six weeks to submit her information. I think my final application included letters of recommendation, some of my case law and opinions, and I think it was about 150 pages. Then in January, she got a call from the governor's staff asking her to come in for a final interview. Listening to the governor interact with his staff and interact with me, I found that to be a fascinating experience. For now, Justice De Janeiro will run to keep her seat, which she'll hold through the end of the year. She'll set in on her first set of cases next week. Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.